Greetings from the General Conference World Headquarters in Silver Spring, Maryland. As the Ministry of Chaplains expands worldwide, Adventist Chaplaincy Ministry is also experiencing growth. This month, I'd like to update you on several strategic plans that ACM is implementing. During the ACM GC World Advisory in March 2016, changes to the ACM GC Working Policy were recommended by the ACM Division Directors. Those changes were approved in the 2016 Fall Annual Council. On December 5, 2016, the ACM Working Policies of the West Central African Division, the East Central Africa Division, and the Southern Africa Indian Ocean Division were voted and certified by the ACM Committee. These policies include endorsement, guidelines for chaplains in those divisions. We congratulate Elders Eng, Macalone, and Kumalo for their leadership as ACM directors of those three divisions. Following each general conference session, ACM outlines milestones to meet during the following five years. Today, I'd like to share several of those with you. Chaplains are first pastors. We must never lose sight of our calling to share hope with others who seek answers and a better future. We participated last year in ribbon meetings we witnessed commitments of more than 60 people who were ready to receive Christ as their Savior. Many others continue to study and prepare for baptism. To reflect Jesus, we must know Him personally. In your daily schedule, have you pledged to spend time in Bible study every day and prayer? ACM encourages all chaplains to include this time as you fill your calendar with activities. In the future, Look for information about a new series of Bible study guides designed especially for chaplains. Providing education and training of chaplains is a primary goal of ACM. Currently, plans are on the way to develop online continuing classes. We will give you more information as time goes by. Did you know that ACM serves as an umbrella organization for the World Service Organization? more commonly referred to as WSO. The WSO is the official military relations department of the World Seventh-day Adventist Church. Religious support is provided for Adventists who serve in their nation's military in uniform and other expressions of government and public services, as well as provide leadership for the Medical Cadet Corps, a program with dual purpose. During peacetime, MCC cadets serve their communities in disaster relief response. But if Adventists are faced with compulsory military service, their training allows them to serve as non-combatants. Soon you will also hear more about a program called Adventist Service Corps. Adventist Service Corps is designed to prepare our people for alternative programs to military service as they serve their nations, not in uniform, not in the military. WSO functions at the world level and the National Service Organization provides oversight at the division level in each of the 13 regions of the world. During the next five years, the role of both WSO and NSO will expand and develop. You soon will hear more about a WSO initiative of organizing a worldwide conference on non-combatant. Keep up to date with ACM activities through our Facebook group called Adventist Chaplaincy Ministry, on our Twitter feed at Adventist Chaps. You can also create a profile in the ACM database. You will find all the necessary information on our website at AdventistChaplains.org. Don't forget to download the archived copies of the Adventist Chaplains and also for God and country. God bless you as you continue to share hope and healing to those you meet.